Alrighty guys, welcome back to some more Tomb Raider. So far this game has been really, really good. And I hope you guys are enjoying it. What do you think we'll find in Kuakiaku? Running water would be nice. I think at this point, I'd settle for no jaguars. <laughs> 18th of July. I awoke this morning at the sight of my father wringing his handkerchief tightly between his two hands. Wide-eyed and unblinking, he stared in Raleigh's direction. Raleigh had passed. Infection had set into his wounds days ago and shortly after, fever took hold. Between fits of cold sweats, laboured groans of pain and demented ramblings, Raleigh had somehow been able to insist on forging ahead. Father had tried to reason with him, telling him to turn back, to let us carry the torch, but Raleigh made it clear. Turning our backs on him would have been leaving him there to die. We forged ahead. We were as far away from civilization as we had ever been, and we foolishly continued to trudge forward. So long, old friend. That was cool. Let's see what's in here. Nope. I'm glad that they're, they brought that back, where they kind of have two or three storylines going. And as you collect um, items, then you get to sort of discover more and more of the story. Um, and I was thinking about that when I was playing the game the other day, like, oh, I hope they do that. It's really cool you get to see different perspectives uh, on the adventure. I know the last one when they were in the snow, they had one of the soldiers' perspective, they had um, one of the goddesses' perspective, and then they had the sort of antagonist. They had his perspective, so that was really cool. Nice. What do we got in here? I'll take that and okay. Anything else? No. There's a road. Let's check it out. Logistics guy, aren't you? Yeah, I'm not the one who drove onto a rotting bridge. Oh, hold up! I got him. Hold on, they're friendlies. Keep your Someone eyes open. Someone check back there. I'll do it. All right, get past right the there. Trinity sure Control. I want this whole area sealed off. Yes, sir. If there's anything here, we're gonna find it. Nice. All right, so if we stay along the wall here, we should be able to stay hidden. The last time this thing was serviced. This is rusty. Don't get distracted, Mendez. What are we looking for here? Anything that moves. Anything that doesn't. They still didn't find that relic. I'd love to be the guy that does. Not me. Why not? I'd be a hero. I'll be dead more likely. No Sick. Place. I'll keep sitting here That's looking awesome. for hostiles. All right. Less talking, more looking, gentlemen. Get off your asses. Yes, sir. All right, so far so good. Quiet. What's your team doing? I'll check. We're not paying them to sightsee. We'll have to go under. Yeah. We know there's the main temple. What we're looking for is any smaller ruins we might have missed before. Okay. It's really wedged in there. I'm afraid if we move it, we'll lose it. We're gonna have to reinforce the bridge. It's gonna be tough to find something to brace against. Why didn't you test the bridge like I told you? Oh, I'm pretty sure we did test the bridge first. Fuck off. I'm not covering for you. Maybe we can pull it out. Okay, maybe. Let me think about that. We can take them. All right. You go left. I'll take these guys. What in God? Hide. Hey, Sammy. Oh, those guys. I told them to test the bridge first. Son of a... Dave! Dave, Sammy, Jesus, Yeah. All right, I should be good here. 
Uh, there we go. He's nice. Should grab these guys. All right, so let's get across. Oh, is there something in there? No. All right, what happened to Jonah? Where did he go? Is he up here already? Anything else? Looks like there's something over here. I'm not sure if I can get to it though. No. Okay keep going Take this. Nice, we got an assault rifle the last of them. and a pistol. That was close. Yeah. New gear acquired. Don't come here. I don't know. Not exactly the civilization I was hoping to run into. Ugh, my arm is so itchy. That means it's healing. I might have liked it better when I was injured. Oh, I know. I'm just trying not to think about my back. You know, my grandmother survived a tsunami in the 60s. What happened? She lost friends. Her family lost their business. But after that, she could feel things coming. Volcanic eruptions, <laughs> storms. There's a lot of talking in this game. Like her and uh, Jonah are constantly talking back and forth. Come on. There we go. Alright. So, objects covered in white cloth. Cloth or covered in oil can be ignited. Nice. Um, have to select the bow. And hit RB. To craft it. Okay. Now, how do I use it? Huh. What happened? No. That did it. There we go. Then press RB to ignite the arrow. Nope. There we go. Nice. Come on, let's go. Any idea what the twins in that riddle are? Could be anything. A pair of monuments or mountains or streams. I suppose we'll know it when we see it. Yeah. Man, I love this setting with the jungle. Oh, here we go. I see people down there. Sweet. I'll let you do the talking. <sighs> Hi. Do you know if there's a place nearby we can stay for the night? How'd you get so deep into the jungle? Did you lose your tour group or something? <sighs> no. There were some guys here before, looking for artifacts. You with them? Trinity. Definitely not. Uh, I need a break anyway. Come with me. I'm sorry to ask so many questions, but the only B&B in town is my place. Well, you can't be too careful. By the way, I'm Jonah. Abby. Lara. Come in, have a seat. Carlos, three. <sighs> so, what are you here for exactly? Well, we were following a riddle when our plane went down. You mean it crashed? Yeah. 
and you just walked out of the crash? Uh, well, you know, it was cruising pretty low. We are looking for Maya ruins. Maya, you know you're in Peru, right? <laughs> yes. Yeah, long story. Oh. Thanks. Well, you don't seem like a typical archaeologist. Oh, she's the archaeologist. I'm, I'm just a cook. Really? Yeah. Have you tried any of our local ceviche yet? It's a specialty. <laughs> Not unless it grows in the jungle. No. Don't tell me you missed our famous fish trees. <laughs> <laughs> Awkward. <laughs> Where did you take this? Um, Mexico. Why? No, oh, I've seen this symbol before. Wow. There are some ruins nearby, and a small rock with something like this carved on it. Do you mind if I take a look around? Oh, be my guest, but I guarantee they're not Mayan. My people were Inca and proud of it. Oh, uh, uh, why don't you rest for a while? Are you sure? I promised you a day off. Well, I'm not going to say no to that. Have fun. You too. Awesome. Let's see. No here, eh? Get used to doing a lot of nothing. Although drinking and sweating helps to break up the day. You're not a local? No, I work a ship that blew into some rocks just outside town. Storm came out of nowhere, sunk the damn thing. Hmm. That sounds about right. Wonder if it'll show you yet. To make a deal? Huh. Cool. Ah, hello. Are you here with the excavation team? No, just passing through. Okay. If you need anything, the market's in the middle of town. You can resupply before you move on. Thank you. My pleasure. Cool. We got ourselves some merchant on the map. Let's talk to a few Two more people. Two years have been working up to never to ask her out. I finally do. And now, who is that guy anyway? <laughs> I think that's Jonah. Um, all right. So new base camp discovered. We'll probably be able to pick up some side quests here. Maybe some equipment as well. Hey, you want to know your way around Kuakiaku? Just ask me. Are you the local tour guide? Mm, I know where to go and who to steer you clear of. I see. Best fish is on the dock, obviously. Tacos are best at El Licor de Cerdo, but his beer is piss warm. <laughs> I'll watch out for that. Oh, and Omar, stay away from that guy. You don't need his kind of trouble. Thinks he can just come to town and take what he wants. Right. Well, I'll be sure to keep an eye out for trouble. <laughs> keep them both open. All right, what do we got? Mission, there's our first side quest. Thank God. The storm barely affected the village. The epicenter was closer to the plane. But it could have been much worse. What have I done? What if the earthquake hits here? Hundreds of people will die. I need to find a way to stop it. All right, so first off, we unlocked fast travel. That's pretty cool. So we will be able to fast travel to all the camps that we had found before. It's like there's, what is this? Uh, just won't let me even stop there. So that's cool. And we got uh, some upgrades that we can make. Uh, let's see. So let's start with the rifle, I guess. Um, so we can upgrade the damage, accuracy. And what is this? The reload speed and the ammo capacity. I think, I think I'll do damage first. If I can't, oh no, I can't. This is the only one available. Okay, uh, rate of fire, why not? Let's do it. All right, and now let's see if we can still upgrade the pistol. 
Four upgrades, sweet. Okay, so let's do damage for sure for the pistol, because they usually don't they don't do as much damage. Let's do the accuracy. We'll just do all of them. If we can. No. Okay. So that should be good. Alright, let's close that. And let's go ahead and upgrade our skills. Actually, you know what? Before we do that, there's some other things here. We got outfits. Um, oh, this is cool. So let's try on something different for a little while. We'll do... Maybe do the classic Tomb Raider, if they have it on here. Let's see. Survivor, Adventurer, uh, Commando Desert Tank, Infiltrator, Shadow Run. I don't see... Oh, here we go. Tomb Raider 2. That's probably the most iconic one. Let's do that. Whoa. <laughs> what happened to the graphics? They look so bad. They got... Yeah, look at that. So it goes from modern day to just, like, terrible... <laughs> Let's just do this anyway. This will be fun. Just for a little bit. All right. Um, oh, my God. It's like potato mode. Let's see. Skills. Um, we have one skill point. I think we're getting to the point where everything is going to cost two now. But let's just double check. Um, oh, I have zero skill points. Oh, interesting. You know what? On second thought, I think we have to switch back. I, I don't think I can do this. Um, yeah, yeah I, I won't. It just it won't work. All right, so let's look at these. We got commando, desert tank, survivor, adventurer. Kind of digging the survivor. Let's go with this. All right, and. Let's look around the village a little bit more, and then we'll get on with the main quest. I don't want to get too sidetracked, but I also kind of want to open up all the quests just so they're available. Have you seen my husband or my daughter? I don't think so. Where did you last see them? They spend their nights with the stars, sparkling and waving at me. But in the morning, they travel to the river. Oh. I usually see them shining there, but the storm muddled the waters. I know they're down there. I know they are. All right, so look at that. We found some gold. Cool. And I wonder if this is the market. Bet you've never seen anything like this, huh? This is my last one. Sold the rest to that commander fella. He was a little intense, but hey, he bought all my stock, didn't he? Well, except this one. Runs smooth, never breaks down. It's a real beaut, isn't it? Uh, well... No, I'm serious. My wife here, she hasn't been the same since the accident. But the gentle hum, it helps her relax. I'm glad. Hmm. Okay. <laughs> kind of random. There used to be a temple on the island over there. But all that's left is a couple crumbled walls. And one stone pillar, it looks like. That's more a statue than a pillar. Real intricate work. A college professor came out to study it a few years ago. Did he tell you what he learned? He said it didn't make any sense. Was pretty angry about it, too. Said we tried to trick him or something. All right. All right, I think I'm going to get back on with the story. I do want to check out the merchant, though. Where's he? Let me... Can I mark that? That's a side mission. Yeah, all right, well, we're heading that way. This is pretty cool. Lots of detail, I like that. They really make it feel like people live here, you know? All right, so we're heading that way, but I do want to check out, oh yeah, he's right straight ahead. Should be in here. Yeah, here we go. Nice. Got some stuff to trade if you're looking. Hello. Let me guess. Omar sent you to shake me down. Well, I'm not giving that bastard anything. What are you talking about? What am I? I'm sorry. I I saw that knife and gone and figured. Yeah, never mind. Are you looking for anything in particular or just browsing? What do you have? What do I have? This is Kuwaki Yaku. One of the greatest archaeological sites in South America. 
Well, it could be. It should be. If it weren't for pillagers? Exactly. Omar and his thugs are after money, not history. I have items of cultural significance for sale. They may be damaged, but they're worth restoring. Let me show you what I have. All right, so he's got a couple different pistols. Um, assault rifle. How much money do I have? I have 3,019. Okay. A pistol sight. That actually would be pretty cool. I'm going to take one of those. Uh, suppressor. That's good as well. I could take both of those, I think. No, not quite. Hmm. Uh, pistol ammo patch. Let's see. What's this? Boots worn by a hunter. Ability to craft more ammo. I think I'm going to take the sight. No, I think I'm going to take the suppressor. Let's get that first. Excellent choice. And oh, I wish I had enough for this, but I don't I'm just yet. Ready to do business. All right. I wonder if it's equipped automatically. I don't think. All right. Let's keep rolling. Here's a little something right here we can take. Jonah. I found Incan ruins, but I think the foundation of the temple is older. Yeah, Abby remembered where she saw that symbol. It's inside the temple somewhere. Great. Tell her thank you for me. I'm right here. You can thank me by not breaking anything. <laughs> I'll be right there, Lara. Tony Rea, the Incan god of the moon. He was relatively low in status, so he didn't have a mate. This tells the story of how he reshaped his sperm into the form of a fruit, which impregnated the goddess Kavirka when she ate it. <laughs> his pregnancy came as quite a surprise since Kavirka was a virgin. But when her son was born, the boy immediately solved the question of his paternity by crawling right towards Kony Rea. Kavirka was so humiliated by Kony Rea's low standing that she fled with her son to Peru, where they turned into coastal rocks. Hmm. All right. I don't know if I said this before, but I do really appreciate that they have her... They have her do these voiceovers. It's nice. I, you don't have to read everything, you know? All right, let's talk to this guy. Let's talk to one more guy before we head in. I can hear them calling from under the earth. The voices. The old gods. Maybe you just need to rest. No. See for yourself. See where the breath of the gods rises from the womb of the earth. Listen to their pained howls. I have noticed that. Where is this breath? You'll see. You'll hear it. Perhaps you can ease their suffering. All right. We got a tomb up there. Very cool. Hey, looks a lot bigger on the outside. What'd you do? <laughs> Turn a look. Eshel and Shakshel, the twins come together. <sighs> what is it? Laura, I... <clears throat> What? Abby said not to break anything. I'm not breaking it. I'm restoring the original. Someone was trying to hide it. <clears throat> the twins come together before following the path of the living. It's been tampered with. Like that thing in Mexico. This must lead to the next clue. Go. I'll stay here. See what else I can find. <sighs> Sounds good. Twins. 
life and death. Jonah, I found the temple. Great. Oh no. Damn. Trinity already there, trying to blast their way in. I'm gonna take a closer look. I think I'm going to end the video here, guys, before we get into this next uh, part of the adventure. But I hope you're enjoying the series so far, and I look forward to the next one.